My name is Patrick Stockbridge and I am running the Try It Coventry Wellbeing Choir. We're running our sessions at 10.30 in the morning and it's for anyone who uh, just feels like they want to get out of the house and have a sing in a very low pressure environment and meet some new people and uh, it's been a lovely experience so far. So we've seen all different sorts of music, obviously Christmas around the corner, we've just started a few Christmas songs. Uh, we've also sung lots of rounds, we've sung lots of kind of pop songs, some Carol King, some Blues Brothers, uh, and then we've done some sailor sea shanty songs. So a massive variety of different songs, and it all kind of stems from music that I just hope people enjoy singing. Over the last few years, we've been doing lots of Zoom choirs, and I've just picked the favourites from all those Zoom choirs to bring to this group. Doing things in person has been exhausting. It's actually got more, got more climatised to it throughout the term, but it's also so much more rewarding getting to hear the singing properly. And you can rehearse things as well. You know, obviously this choir is very low pressure. We're not practising things to a, like a perfect standard, but at the same time, it's lovely to be able to like listen to things and change things and sing louder and try singing it in a different way, um, which we just haven't been able to do online. So it's a privilege and it makes you appreciate what you had before uh, the pandemic a lot more. <laughs> so there's the sort of physical aspect to singing in terms of breath control. We're all rushing around all the time and just having that sort of control of your breath really, really helps. There's also the community aspect of meeting people, which I think, again, lots of people have been starved of that over the last couple of years. And then also just being able to sing things that are joyful as well. It's been amazing how it's sort of built up over week by week. People have been bringing a friend and it's kind of built up organically by people bringing people who they think the choir will be useful for. So I've been working in Coventry for a long time, worked in lots of the schools. We run the city council choir and a choir at the UHCW, the hospital. And I think there's always a kind of limit on the people who can attend because it's always for a specific purpose or for a specific kind of group of people. Um, and it's just really important that City of Culture embraces everyone and gives everyone the opportunity to uh, have that same experience that these other people are getting. Oh. Oh.